so I was doing some handstands in, in the South Bank area and you know I was up doing my thing and I could see out of the corner of my eye like someone put their stuff pretty close to mine mm -hmm. and then was standing around and I'm like oh okay that's like they they put their stuff too close for comfort yep. without saying anything mm -hmm. I was like all right well I'm in the middle of a set but I'll, I'm, I'm gonna have to deal with something when I come down I yep. didn't know yeah. what I was gonna have to deal with and it was this guy and uh looked relatively normal at first I would say like imagine a fatter Joey mm. uh, like 110 well this guy I think he said he was 110 115 kilos yep. uh, the perfect uh, way to do uh, handstands yeah, yeah a squat uh, definitely shorter so imagine like a 5 foot 6 fat Joey yeah. and that's that's, it. that's episode, episode like. 5 if anyone wants to see what, what that's all but, looks yeah. like and uh, he was like uh, hey man you, you mind if I join you for a little bit like I'm thinking of doing some handstands as well I was like yeah. oh shit and I was thinking so you're like cool you know yeah. maybe this is a former gymnast who's let himself go but you know can still can do still some cool do stuff the whole thing. yeah that was not the case <laughs> he started talking about oh man yes yeah, so I'm gonna I really want to do these handstands I think it'll like take me a little bit to learn them mm. and then he was saying yeah I really want to do a backflip as well um you know the matrix I want to mm. I want to do that thing where you you jump off the wall yep. and so he sort of like ran up to a wall and just kicked it <laughs> and and, 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 and at this stage uh i was i was just like this this exact thing that i was talking mm. about this is someone who theoretically thinks they can do anything mm. but has had zero zero real life experience yeah, of like trying to do a handstand um, you know in his mind he thought he could do a handstand within a same, couple of months same with his idea of, of uh, royalties royalties on his business idea yes yes yeah. yes so this yeah. was the the same guy so after chatting with him a bit, I realized like, okay, I think there's something like a little bit wrong with him. Mm -hmm. Like there's mentally, I'm, I'm not sure what it is, but there's, there's something he's strange in like a, a not mere mortal strange way, but like, yeah. like some wiring, some connections in his yep. brain aren't, aren't, aren't connected. Mm. And yeah, he, he was like, he would just tell me about all his ideas of creating a, he mixed peanut butter, uh, sorry, he mixed a uh, uh, C4. Um, C4, C4 protein with shake ice cream? with uh, Peter's. Peter's, Peter's ice, cream. ice cream. Peter's ice cream. Yeah, got to make, got to get that right. And it was like, right. man, it tasted really good, uh, and it was so you know beneficial for me. I was fucking it, yeah, eating ice cream, <laughs> mate. Um, and and he was like, yeah, so I'm thinking of, uh, you know, I, w I want this to be a product. I'm thinking of like contacting Peter's. I'll and then it was just like, I'll get the royalties. You know, I'll I'll get a cut. They can do all the distribution mm. and and the packaging and whatnot. Uh, and then they'll give me the royalties. And then uh, you know, if, if my wife wants a new car, bam. And that's what he was doing. Was like, bam. Want to go for a holiday somewhere? Bam. Uh, need to, like, pay off Centrelink? Bam. It's just done. <laughs> I was like, 